6 in the morning and we're heading to Maine. I don't think there's anything else I need to say, but we're heading to Maine. Maine is the main thing I want to do today. We made it to Maine. Well, I mean, we're not at the house yet, but we made it at least to the state. And we made it to the, where the relative area. Can you not sing? I tried to be fun and quiet in the background. You gonna redo it? No, stop. No, stop. We made it to Maine. Look how pretty. It's raining. Trees. Really, that's all I can show you right now. Just road and trees and pretty. We made it to Maine. I am so my. I don't have makeup on, but we made it to Maine. We have a nice little cute room. It has a TV and a and a heater. You're gonna get dizzy because I'm dizzy. We have a heater, which is nice because it's really cold here. It's like 60 degrees. But um, we have a view. Let's show you the view. If you look closely, you can see the serial killer in the distance. We went down like the longest road to get here. I'll film it tomorrow because it was so creepy scary. Very poorly lit. I'm poorly lit. Dun dun! But yeah, we made it to Maine. Ah! Hi. Uh, good morning. Uh, it is... Monday. Uh, and I never mentioned before that why we're in Maine. Uh, family vacation. And we're in Bar Harbor, Maine. Well, the house isn't in Bar Harbor, it's a town or two or three over. But we're in Maine, up in Bar Harbor area in the Cato National Park. So that's what we're doing up here. Um, today we're going to the new Jordan Pond house. We'll probably go to the old Jordan Pond house a different day, but one of those days. Um, I think we're driving on the Park Loop Road also today. So we'll be doing that, and I'll record some of it. But uh, yeah, and now I showed the room last night, but something I noticed overnight, <laughs> look at this. As the ceiling, so it's one, two, three, four, five. I have no idea why there's five electric sockets on the roof or ceiling of our bedroom, but there is. So it's a little weird, but it's acceptable because we're in Maine and I'm excited to be in Maine. Yay! So yeah, today we went to Jordan Pond, the new one. Uh, apparently what happened was the people that used to own it for a long, 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 long time lost their ownership of it. I don't know the circumstances, but they lost their ownership of it. So then they were gone for a year, and then they bought it, uh, the, a restaurant in the Astoria Inn. Yeah, and then they opened, like, the new Jordan Pond. I don't think it's actually called that, <laughs> but that's what we're calling it. So I went to that day, and it was really good. Um had popovers, which I don't know how to describe bigger other than... Bigger croissants. What? They're bigger croissants. Bigger croissants. I would say that they're less flaky, heavier. Heavier, bigger croissants. You saw a video of them. Hopefully you can guess what they look like and taste like. I don't know. They're delicious. So we had that and tea 
Um, and wings. They had wings. Wings were good. Uh, yeah, so we just did that, and then we came home. It was kind of a lazy day today. Good morning! Today is a whale watching day. I don't know what else we're doing, but we're going whale watching. <laughs> it's really early. <laughs> whale watching got cancelled. I don't know what the plan is. Adventures. Hello. So, yeah, whale watching got cancelled this morning. And now it's many hours later because we came home, ate a big breakfast, and then all of us proceeded to nap. For a while. <laughs> but now we're going to Deer Isle, which is an island very close to here. Best descriptions. <laughs> so we're headed over there. I'm glad we'll get to do something because, well, it's not something that can be cancelable. You can't cancel an island. Hopefully. We'll find out. But we're going to head over there, so... Lego! So what are we doing? Trying to light a stove. Grill. Got the ignition one lit. And this is how I die. You're gonna turn on the camera and it'll go immediately. It's gonna be like, ha! I'm so scared. Don't put it that close to my face. It's just I turn it and it just doesn't. Closing the top and like this would create a backdraft, wouldn't it? Killing everyone. Okay. Let's not do that. I'd rather not die today. Well, it's the wind that's keeping it from catching. We need to block the wind. Problem is, our beautiful view prevents us from doing anything like that. Oh, got it. I got the one. She says she got it. I don't because believe it. Because you turned around. Come over here and you can see the blue flame. I'm sorry, beautiful view. Don't put my camera near the fire. Come look at the fire. Don't put the camera near it. Just look at it. That one lit instantly. I'm only gonna like the three of them because I don't wanna have to do anything else. And we couldn't get the fourth one to work last time anyway. Yeah, that's true. That's a bug. You're a bug. So the house we're staying at is right near a river. Um, but it's like a mini walk over to it and I keep hearing noises and I'm scared an animal's gonna kill me. Good morning, by the way. So we're walking oh gosh, we're walking over to the river, down to the river bed, bank, what's the river called? But uh, we're going through nature. That's Dan. We're going, oh my gosh. A little fire pit and a little, little picnic table. I forgot what it's called. Big rocks. That's the house up, up there. And uh. There's a horseshoe crab down here. Oh yeah, the neighbor. No, the um. Oh, who was it? The. Someone that fixed something for us when we first got here told us that there were horseshoe crabs here. Maybe not, you never know. I hit it with a stick. It's a... To check to see if it was alive, to be clear. And it was a very thin stick. Where's your crab? Possibly dead, maybe most likely dead. Looks like it's trapped between the rocks. Oh no. But yeah, this is the river. So. Now we're going this way. I'm really awful at holding this camera and also not dying. The ground, eek. the ground is wet because it, it rained really, really bad the first day we were here, when well, my family was here, and um, now the ground's like, I thought I heard something and it just scared me. So and the ground's now kind of moist and wet and stuff. <laughs> so yeah, 
Okay. I'm editing this. Okay. So yeah, yeah, that's that's the the river outside our house. It's our view. So that's a so pretty. Oh god, no, that side's the cliff. Cool. Oh lord, I'd rather not die today. Oh, babe. What? Don't get hurt. Jesus. So now we're going to drive over to Bar Harbor, just him and me. My family went to Canada, but we are going to go over to go look at the shops. They're paying drug charges. No, they're not. But uh, we're going to head over there and maybe go through some shops Ooh. in downtown, maybe get some food. Food will be good. So this is that really creepy road we had to go down. Imagine this a little darker. It's just covered in tree. Just tree and forest. And just really long and hilly. Total serial killer forest. And that's what we saw when we first got to the house. So we thought we were going to die. So we just got it. Got it? I'm so good at speaking. Um, so we just made it to Bar Harbor, the island. We're still uh, 10 miles-ish to the downtown area that we're going to. Keep left on Bar Harbor Road. Shut up. Uh, it is so rainy outside. Look at that. Look at that. That view is beautiful, but all that rain though. It's just so rain though. Anyway, so we're heading down to Bar Harbor, downtown Bar Harbor, to... Keep on Bar Harbor Road. Shut up. Dude, it's worse than the trucks back home. Uh, we're heading down there to just do a little shoppy shopping. Look at some stuff. Drive it's raining, so oh my god. Shopping in the coffee ride at music. So yeah, we're heading down there to go some shoppy shopping. Ah. So I didn't record any of us shopping. Um, sorry. Uh, it was raining, so I didn't want to bring my camera out. I just don't like getting cameras wet and, and even like my phone and stuff. Um, so we went to go eat somewhere right after we dropped our stuff up at the car, and someone walking by pointed out that my tire is almost kind of flat. Kind of. It's pretty bad. Not bad. It's not bad. It's, it's okay. It's all right. It's just, well, we're now driving out of town to go get an air pump and hopefully we can survive on an air pump until I get home to realize if I need a new tire or if it's just like a patch or something. We're not quite sure. But you know. So life is. So life goes. Yeah.